What up, what up, what up? It's your boy Creek D in the building. And today I'm going to show you how to make these thumbnails for free. Free today, free tomorrow, free forever. Free, free. You dig? This real easy peasy lemon squeezy. What it's called is pick maker. And what you want to do is you're going to uh, create your free. All you got to do is type in pickmaker.com. You ain't got to sign up or none of that. And you're going create to create your thumbnail for free. First, you can pick for your thumb, YouTube channel art, YouTube thumbnail, IG, or you can start from scratch. Bam, there you go. So you're going to click on that and let this load. I'm not feeling good, y'all, so I'm kind of dry today, but I just wanted to get this video out. All right, now once you get inside this pick maker, you can uh, use a pre-built thumbnail right here. They got plenty of pre-built pre where you can change the stuff on it. They got, you can use stickers, icons, frames, photos, charts, shapes, illustration patterns, and cat characters. They got background colors, regular or gradient. See? You can add text. There's all kinds of different kind of text. You can use the templates to change all this. <clears throat> or you can upload your own photos. See? So what I'm going to do, I'm going to start right now. I'm going to just use the photo that I uploaded. My picture right there. Okay. Now I don't want all this stuff in that picture. You see the, the square area right here? This is where you're working in. I don't want all this stuff in the picture. So what I'm going to do, is I'm going to click right here. Click on the picture. You click this little magic wand, look at the background remover right here. And you click on that. Okay, now you can take, you can remove this background yourself, or they got a tool to remove it. Yes, proceed. I'm going to use the tool. And it's going to identify everything in the background and all that for you. Like I said, I ain't feeling good, y'all, but I had to get this video out. I've been sick for two days straight. You dig, but I can't let that slow me down because I'm always sick. You still never know it. You got to wait for all this stuff to get the stuff out, identifying the people, props, in your photo. Okay. Now what you want to do is take out what you don't want. You don't want that second person or this tie, whatever that is. You take that out, and you're going to go to next. Okay, now you took that stuff out. What you can do you start adding the stuff back that you need. Click that plus. You're going to go over here. And you're going to put the helmet back. Because you know something the helmet missing. You took some of that out. So you're going to put all that back. See? Put all that back that you missing. Now, to take away, you're going to click the take away. You can make your brush size, whatever size you need, smaller, larger. You're going to work with Take all the stuff out that you don't need. Okay. Like right here. Let's see, whatever this is. I need my brush bigger because I'm blind, y'all. Okay, right here. Take this out. Whatever that is. You know what I mean? Bam. Now you done got that. Now what you want to do is go to done. Bam. You click done. Here's your picture right here. You took all your background out. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy, like I said. You can put an outline around it. What you want to do for your outline, you'll click on the picture, and you can click. It's going to say sticker. Click on that. Where it says sticker. You can choose the background color. See? You change the color. See that? They're going to put your outline around. You can make it fatter, smaller, in a stroke. See that? Easy peasy. Let me squeeze it, y'all. Tell you, it's not hard about that. Put your board around. Make it big or small, like I said. You done. Bam. Now what you can do, that's kind of ugly, but we're going to keep it because I'm this far. Now what you're going to do is you're going to go back and get your background. They got properties. You can use photo background. Let's see what they got right here. Okay, I'm going to use this background. Now what you want to do is you're going to right click and you're going to move this to the back. Right click, move to back. I'm going to put that picture back on front. See that? This stuff real easy, y'all. I'm telling you. I'm trying to find something that I really want to use. But I just for the video, we're going to keep this. Click on the picture. You can resize it. 
See that? Now you want to do this, you can make it black and white, sun bright, you can change it right here. We work with this stuff, y'all. See that? All you got to do is change this stuff, make it how you, however you want it. But this is real easy. The main thing is getting that picture done. And that's so easy, even a, even a kid can do it. If you make a mistake, just click this arrow right here, undo, 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 undo. So you undo everything you read, just did. Now, you can put you some text on there. You, you, you can choose one of these templates right here, or you can use your own. You can start from scratch up here. Add bold, add medium, add regular. See what this do. Okay, now you can, you can edit that. Just double click and take the words off. Double click on the bottom. Take that out. How to make. See that? You can, you can click on this and move it down. You can get rid of this background. You don't want that background, you can get rid of it. Make the text bigger, smaller. It's real easy, y'all. All you got to do is work with it. How to make YouTube thumbnail. We're going to put, put one more thing on there. And, and you can also double add the same title to get you an effect. Let me show you. Free. F R E E. Click right up here and you can change the color right there. Free. Bam. Now you're going to add that same text again. Get rid of the word. F R E E. And you can put a different color on that one. And put a red on it. Bam. Now what you're going to do is take that and move it. See that? And there you go. You got your. Let me make these bigger, y'all. And you got your double words. You got your outline. You got y'all. You got to work with this stuff. All you got to do is keep watching this video. I ain't got nothing to gain. I'm showing y'all this stuff. I ain't got nothing to gain. To win or lose, you can use it or not. I'm just letting you know. It's how easy this stuff is. Stop listening to the hype and start listening to your boy. See that? See how they work? You can make that a little bigger. This, you just got to work with You got to learn this stuff. All this stuff is easy. Bam. How to make a YouTube thumbnail free. Easy peasy. And then you're going to save it. There's a lot of other stuff you can do. Let's see. Like I said, they got the pre built You can just use one of these. You can, use, you can just use one of these. Let me show you how to use one of these real quick. I just take this for instance. Bad temper. Okay, you're gonna get rid of that. Bam. Yeah. You don't want to. I'm gonna show you how I show you. You're gonna go over here. You're gonna go to your picture. Whatever picture you upload it. Upload it, download it, reload it, underload it, overload it, however your picture at. You're gonna click on your picture. You're gonna click this magic wand thing. Try to make this video. Yes. Or you can do it yourself. It's up to you. You can. Take the background out yourself, or you can let them do it. I'm going to let them do it, because that's easy peasy, lemon squeezy. So I'm going to show you. You can even do this for just to use a picture for anything, identifying the foreground. <clears throat> boy, we're going to get to this video, because I'm telling you, boy, your boy feeling bad. Identifying the people and props, and there you go. Now, what you want to do is you're going to click on what you don't want. That second person, that tie, and you're going to click on that. Okay, it took that out. Like I said, it's going to take some of your stuff. All you got to do is go to add and add it right back. Go to add, add that right back in there. Whatever you're missing in the helmet, just add it right back. If you, if you put too much in there, you just click the takeaway. Just like map, add, take away, add, take away. This free, y'all. Free now, free tomorrow, free forever. Promise you that. And then you're going to go to next. Go to done. Once you click the done, 
You're gonna go up here to the top. If you want a line outline, you're gonna click on this right here and it's gonna give you an outline. See? You make that outline big, small, however you want to. You do the inner stroke, outer stroke. How this this is how you want to do it. Show the inner stroke. Make that a little bigger. Inner stroke. You gonna see that? Outer. I don't mess with that inner. All right, you're gonna change the color, whatever color you want it to be, whatever size you want it to be. And bam, you're gonna drop them in, you're gonna drop them in your fingernail. See that? The thumbnail. Now, if you wanted to face the opposite direction, all you gotta do is think of this one. No. This one, watch this. Bam! You flip them the other way. See that? This is real easy, y'all. So easy, a kid can do it. I tell you. Y'all better start using this free stuff. Let's make this small. Might well make it look like something while I'm in here. You dig? Adjust on it right there. Then we're gonna get rid of this, we're gonna get rid of this bag. Now, this two. And then you click on this temp and we're gonna edit that. Double click. You do two of you can push enter and you go on the bottom. C A C M B N A I L. This is real easy, I'm telling y'all. You can uh change the fonts right here. You can right here you can change the what font you want. Watch this. Change the fonts on that joint. You already know you can change the color right here. Get rid of this. Delete. Bam. Yeah. You down. You down. Okay. All right, so we're going to get rid of this bag. We're going to leave this bag. Get rid of that. Yes. Put this back up. We get rid of this pyramid thing, shape. We remove that. Put it on there. Click on this. We remove that. We're going to leave that. Bam. Yes. How to. We're going to change that color to a, like a yellow so it stand out. Bam. Got some stuff you got to make. We're going to change this color on the Z2 to a yellow. It's easy, y'all. Make that large. You can make the little the words large. All you gotta do is just watch this video. I don't, you can watch it. And you need the thumbnails. It's up to you. I'm just putting this out here for y'all. Then we got we need make. We ain't got make, so we're gonna go over here and add a text. We're gonna add something simple. Double click. M A K E. Change that color to yellow. Bam, like that. Then we're gonna move him over. Click on him again. Why we right there? We don't want that. We're gonna click on this. We're gonna make move that right there. Move this up right there. You can do whatever you want to do with this stuff. It's, it's all your choice. You can make a bow. You can make it italicize, underline it. You can adjust it. All that stuff, y'all. It's called Pick Maker. Uh, free pickmaker.com. I'm gonna leave a link in the description below. You already know how to do it, but I ain't feeling good, so it's time for your boy to go lay back down and like I do it. I'm gone.